who don't know. Ooh, what is that? Ooh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Towards my car, it hit my window, cracked my windshield. Okay, so here is a quick outfit of the day. Father's Day, Daughter's Edition. I got this two-piece set on that I got from Shein. I love it. The quality is really good. I love how these, um, this pair of pants is lined in the leg area. So when you go outside, you can't see through the pants. I love this little blazer top. It's really, really cute. It's really comfortable. And then these shoulder pads are a little bit padded. And then I have on these Christian Louboutins. These are the Erizas. And this is the most comfortable pair of Christian Louboutins in my opinion. So, that's it. guys we are starting this vlog off in the car the lighting will get better i swear oh someone's coming the lighting will get better i swear but i know we're starting this vlog off in the car right now i have a hair consultation so specifically a color consultation oh. the stylist that i go to she does not color your hair the same day you choose your color because she basically wants to educate you regarding like how your hair will actually color based on the, your natural hair color. So I'm not really familiar with the color game. I'm super excited about getting my hair colored because this will be my first time getting my hair permanently colored. So I'm thinking about doing a separate video on like the process and how the hair turned out. I'll include a picture on the screen regarding what color I actually want to get. I wanted her to see my my hair in its natural state, like the color, which she's seen my hair in its natural state. I'm not going for like a crazy color or anything like that. I'm very, very simple when it comes to my hair. Like I said, this is the first time I've ever gotten my hair permanently colored in my adult life. <laughs> so I'm super excited about that. And um, the only time that I've like experimented with color was if I got like a sew-in or something like that. So in my apartment tour video that I posted, um, my hair was like a really beautiful chocolate arban color. I'm getting my real hair colored and I just really hope that it turns out good because like I said, I've never gotten my hair colored. All right, y'all. So I made it to the salon. I'm really early. <laughs> I'm like 30 minutes early. My plan was to come on this side and grab something to eat before my appointment. But I don't want to be late. Um, it is lunchtime. It's like 11.51. So I didn't want to get caught up in like lunchtime traffic. So I just came straight here. And then I may go and grab me some food or something to drink after I leave here. After I leave my consultation. But it's 11.51. My appointment is at... 1220 I believe I'm gonna double check the confirmation but I believe my appointment is at 1220 but as y'all can see the sun is shining it looks like it didn't even rain earlier when I left the house when I left my apartment earlier it was like drizzling in my head I was thinking it's it's not gonna continue to rain like I already knew it was gonna stop so of course as soon as I pulled out of the garage rain went away but whatever I'll see you guys in the next the next clip I'll be talking to my stylist.
All right, y'all. So I'm leaving the salon and things went great. I'm super excited. I'm a little nervous because like this is the first time that I'll ever be getting my hair. Who is that? This will be the first time that I'll ever be getting my hair permanently colored. And like she basically was just telling me like how it works, like if I'll be doing like maintenance and maintenancing. Alright y'all, so y'all it looks so nice out here. It doesn't even look like it rained. <sighs> hey guys, today is Thursday, June 24th. So I actually had to end the vlog early. So basically after I left the salon, I was on the way to my mom's house. I got on the freeway. There was like this oversized load on the freeway and I was at a safe distance. However, there was like another car like driving all crazy trying to get around the oversized load. I don't know if the plank flew from the oversized load vehicle or if the vehicle that was trying to get around like hit something that was on the freeway. But all I remember was a plank like traveling towards my car. It hit my window cracked my windshield and I, like, I was just so I was so irritated too because like I hate when people drive crazy I feel like that person wasn't driving crazy then that wouldn't have happened but it happened and luckily I have insurance and luckily it doesn't have to be replaced my insurance said they could repair it for free so I can't really complain but um yesterday I didn't really film a lot because after that happened I went home I was just like let me get off of the road I'm so irritated I'm just gonna go home vlog in the following day so here we are today is thursday and um my husband and i are getting ready to go on a little date night we're gonna go to cyclone and i is and we're gonna take you guys with us so definitely stay tuned for that i already know what i'm gonna eat because i'm i'm super hungry right now <laughs> okay so i'm gonna try to stand on my tippy toes so i basically have on this two-piece set it's from Boohoo. I've had this set for like, I want to say like a little over a year or maybe like two years. I can't really remember, but I have on this super cute um, two piece set. And this hat, I got it from Forever 21. It was very random. I went inside of Woodlands Mall. I think this was like last week. I had to use the restroom. So I stopped at Woodlands Mall to use the restroom. Um, and then on the way out, it was like a favorite between one that I passed through. And they had some really cute fedora hats. So I was like, okay, I need to go back and get a few more because they had like a lot of colors. But yeah, this is the outfit. It's very casual, very appropriate for Cyclone Anaya's. Okay, guys, so our reservations are at 7 30. It is 7 02 right now. We're going to be on time. That sun is so bright. We're going to be on time. I'm not concerned about that. I don't like being late for things, by the way. Things that I care about. <laughs> I'm starving. I'm so happy that we're doing a date night, guys. The last time we went on a date, we went to North Italia, which is a really good restaurant. It's really good. It's an Italian restaurant. We may go back. I love North Italia. Like, it's so good. They have, like, this truffle butter bread my god so good but yeah so
all right y'all so we made it i had to call them just to let them know that we were going to be running like 10 minutes behind because i didn't know what the parking was going to look like it's 7 28 our reservation was at 7 30 i told them we would be there like 10 minutes behind so we're doing good babe's on the way to get a parking ticket because the restaurant is literally right here so we're not even gonna valet we're just gonna park here i'm just super excited to be on a day with my husband i'm hungry like words can't describe how hungry i am right now and i cannot wait to get some food mm -hmm. Okay guys, so we just ordered. We ordered the same thing. We got the We got the brisket enchiladas. And then we ordered a few drinks. It's kind of loud in here, so I'm not going to be too long, but y'all so we just finished our dinner it was so good so we're getting ready to go and get ice cream guys we're getting ready to go and get some ice cream she brought my so, tongues you, you got heartburn <laughs> yeah so there's no car sushi guys we've been to this one before and then they also have one on West Highway don't fall down the drainage that's my fear <laughs> <laughs> no I'm serious imagine like stepping on it okay guys so we were supposed to go to we were confused so there's like a few like dessert spots over here there's one called sweet which is a cafe and then there's one place that's called Jin's Ice Cream. He didn't want to wait in line. Nope. I don't think the line was that long. Yeah, it was. But so now we're just gonna go to what we're gonna go where we know best in the Heights. There's a place called Smush Ice Cream in the Heights. So we're just gonna go there. And if the line is long, we're going to wait because I personally feel like 
By the time we get to Smush, we would have been in Jen's ice cream. So I don't understand. I personally feel like we should have just gone to Jen's ice cream just to kind of try something different. No, but it's hot. It is hot. So guys, so we're in city center. For those who don't know. Oh, what is that? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Did you see it? Uh, I don't know what it was. It literally looked like it was getting ready to, to grab me. I was like, first of all, I don't do bugs. If you know, then you know that I don't do bugs. funny story so they actually did a giveaway I think in like 2019 where you had to like tag like a bunch of people and like a post and follow or whatever and I won <laughs> so this isn't our first time here but this time we got um, milkshakes they do milkshakes now typically we do ice cream but oh cool is this mine or yours oh hold on yeah, trying to steal my milkshake, bro. <laughs> <laughs> trying to steal my. Oh, sorry about that. Trying to steal my milkshake, man. Thank you. So much, so much fun. You happy to see your mommy? Oh, you happy to see daddy? Oh, oh, really? All that happened when we were gone? Are you kidding me? I'm gonna end this vlog, get cleaned up, 
it's late what time is it it's like it's almost 10 o'clock so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog see you guys in the next video Thank you.